I noticed this giant bug and immediately grabbed onto my finger. It perfectly slid in between my light. Okay, hold on. Here, grab on, grab on. I was like, I gotta get this butterfly out of here. I tried to wiggle it out as slow as I could. There you go. There you go. It immediately fell to the ground with a broken wing. I've learned that you are not supposed to touch the wings on butterflies at all. I was up in the mountains, pretty much in the middle of nowhere. My resources were extremely limited. I found out that it was a he. Males have two larger black dots on either one of their wings. He just kind of hung out and he sat on my hand. It was like five minutes, 15 minutes, and then 30 minutes rolled around. We hung out for about two hours, then it became dark. I was car camping, so I put him next to my car. Didn't know if he'd still be there when I woke up the next morning, but when I woke up, I came back to the spot and he was still sitting right there. My very first thought was, he's now my responsibility and I'm going to take care of him. I knew that I couldn't just let him suffer. He's like so helpless and defenseless. I went to a local pet store. I had no idea this is how my day would be going today. So far I've said the words, do you sell bug enclosures three times? Here is my banana water. I tried to give him food and shade so that he'd be comfortable. At one point I had given him an orange slice. All of a sudden now I was friends with a butterfly. I took him to McDonald's. He basically did everything with me for about two days. I felt very connected to him. <laughs> I had him propped up on one of my pillows and he started climbing up the whole pillow, which was pretty unlike him. I'm like, wow, you're actually making some progress here. On the third day, I could see that he was getting really restless. I decided I wanted to see if he would be able to fly off on his own. I was driving through the mountains and I passed a wildflower field. I put him on my fingers. He hung out for about 10 minutes and then he took off. He flew away. I went over to him because I wanted to see, okay, can you do this again? Then he got off and he flew away again. We kind of had this weird friendship over the past three days. I was just so proud of him. I felt super happy, but I also felt very sad. I knew that I can't keep him forever. Monarchs are now endangered. It's so important to care for each and every one.